It seems the Senate wants to increase taxes, and the House wants to reduce agency budgets. <coughs> so we got about eight weeks of session left. We're, we just kind of hit, about hit the midway mark. How do you reconcile these two directions? Well, I, the question reflects that H.J. spends more time in the Senate offices than I do. So I, I don't pay attention to Senate ideas until a certain point in session. But we do have to, we do have to reconcile them towards the end. Um, so I, um, I actually am somebody, I am, um, we'll see what proposals are before us. The budgets have to agree. Um, I think they're probably, the rec I'm hoping the reconciliation will be that reforms are part of whatever budget we look at. So much money goes off the top, and so much money is unquestioned that we don't get to spend. This is something I like to remind voters of all the time. When you hear about a budget shortfall, that's only one part of the money that you send to state government. And in fact, right now, it's, I think, uh, somewhere between 50, 55, and 57 percent of the money that you send to us gets appropriated by your elected representatives. And so for some 40 odd percent of the money that you send, it's already been represented by previous legislatures, by previous constitutional um, changes. And so you don't have up-to-date modern representation on all of the money that you send to us. It's already been spent previously by previous decisions. And so that shortfall amount, that $900 million shortfall you hear about in the news, that's just the amount of the 56% that we get to spend for you. That's not, the, that's not a reduction in the you know, total amount of, of money that's coming into the state. Now some of those off the top funds are you know, reduced in their in income because of uh, the slowdown in the economy. But the shortfall is a very strictly defined item that doesn't get strictly defined for you in the articles that are out there. So that's, that's an encouraging thing. State government isn't gonna shut down um, when you hear about these shortfalls, uh, but you are not getting represented year by year in over 40% of the budget, and that's the bad news. That's why there has to be reform. 